What's up guys, it's Dylan here, or DM, or DM Game, I'm bringing back another MX Bikes video. Be sure you smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, comment, and also join the Discord, and go follow the TikTok where I've recently been going live playing TCG Card Simulator or Call of Duty, and I think I'm going to start doing MX Bikes. But, today's video, we're focusing on the longest track in MX Bikes history. This is Scrapyard, and I think that there's two different tracks on it. There's short and there's long, and uh, we're ripping the long track, and I'm telling you, boys and girls, this is the longest track in MX Bike history. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It is super flowy. This is a $3 track, and in my opinion, I think it's definitely worth the $3. Um, I bet you it'd be really fun to race and hang out with your friends on. There's some neat sections you can put together. Oh my god. Like this one right here, if I can get it. I don't know if I will be. You can stretch that to a big triple there. I cased it a little bit, but we still got up and over it. Jump into the berm. Oh my god. Dive into the inside rut. But yeah, we're on our road to 300, or, oh my god, we're on the road to 500 subs. We just hit 444, and uh, yeah, I'm trying to hit 500 subs before the year ends, and I believe that we could all do it. Just gotta smash that subscribe button. Oh my god, I love that jump, honestly. You can triple here. I don't know why I didn't, because I always mess up when I don't. I definitely need to triple that next lap. But yeah, this is just like, and there's some out of, like, oh my god. There's other stuff that you can do on this track, like behind me. Hang on. Right over there on the hillside, there's like a small little circle track type thing that's very rough. Like right there to my right, you can see it. And uh, I've, I rode that a tiny bit, not too much. Um, oh my god. Stretch it out. There we go. Gotta remember that this is a big one big tabletop this track has got some monster jumps on it too oh my god we're, we're, we grab bars we're okay we we're not okay we were not okay we did grab bars we did grab bars oh my god and i think in the summer of 2025 i'm going to start doing uh street bike vlogs as i am buying a r6 at some point this winter um, or not during the spring or whatever um, so let me know what you guys think about that if you want me to do them or not um, or if you want me to start like a second channel for vlogging and keep this for MX bikes I don't know it's just up in the air for right now depending on how well the you know how well the YouTube's doing at that point in time and wow I'm too busy talking over here Let's get, let's get dialed in. This is just a little popper. Can scrub it. Oh my god. I bet you if I went full throttle. I wish Trojan and Josh and the Doc would try to go from that takeoff to the other side of that tabletop. I mean, there's not really a big run up, but it would be pretty cool to see. Maybe we'll try it next lap or something. Jump right on over. Oh my god. I think I might do like a per get progression video. Um, go back and see how I used to ride and how bad that was to now. I mean, I have a thousand hours in it. I think I started doing MX gameplay when I had. It wasn't anywhere near. It was probably over a hundred hours. Couldn't have been like 200 or 300. It had to have been over 100. Maybe 150 or something. I mean, granted, that is quite a bit of hours, but on this game, when you get 100 hours, you're just starting to get the feel of it. I mean, 1,000 hours, and I'm just starting to be able to uh, not wreck as I'm about to wreck. Oh my god. These Beta 19 bikes. Um, Tweet, the homeboy Tweet, he built a setup for the Husky 
and it just absorbs a lot of the stuff, a lot of the shocks. There we go. I also think you might be able to whip a 250 around here since I'm in second gear. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. We're gonna cleanly get over that triple. Hoop, puck it. There we go. That was beautiful. That's what I love to do on here. Alright, maybe we can put this together right here real quick. Oh, no. Nope. 360. Taking the, like, as soon as you jump out of the corners on here, it, like, throws you 360. So you just gotta be careful of that. There we go. I do like this little jump here. Go dive inside. Hop over. I bet you if I go outside, I could definitely clear that. Got third gear. Puck it into the triple. Kind of double scrub it. Oh my god. Hop up. I'm losing my rhythm. I'm losing the rhythm, boys and girls. There we go. There we go. And if you guys want more like racing gameplay or tips and tricks or whatever it may be that you guys want to see. Just let me know down in the comments so I can do videos that you guys want to see and not just, you know, riding around or whatever. Oh, no. Or maybe I'll go back through the last year of videos and I will put together the funniest moments or the best crashes that I've had or the most ridiculous moments. I mean, who knows? There we go. Get that brake tap, get the front wheel down. I do like the jumps where you jump out of the corner. There we go. I mean, I think for the most part, this has been a semi-clean lap. Or no, I did wreck. I did wreck once. Next lap, it's going to be a nice, clean, fast lap. Flat right off at the lip. Sets you up beautifully for that. Oh no, bro. You can also, like, kind of come outside and tabletop it. But I cannot tabletop it today. I don't know what that was. We'll triple, triple. Oh my god, get on top of it. Oh my god. If you learn how to do roller sections like that in two corners, you will automatically become the fastest one on the track no matter where you are. If you can do it consistently, because I guarantee you there's a lot of people that can't hit them fast or consistently. I know I could definitely not hit them consistently. Or if, I mean, I can hit them somewhat kind of fast. I'm just very in... See, like... Sometimes I can hit them fast, and other times it's like the previous section there. Oh, that inside is smooth right there. Okay, so there is a finish line. I never knew that. I've done countless laps on this track and have not had a time. Oh my god. I've done countless laps. I have yet to have a time on here, and that's the first time that I've pulled is a four-minute lap time. Yeah, I don't think so, buddy. We're gonna we're gonna get a nice fresh restart because I overjumped that too bad. There we go. Okay. Just jump to the top of it. Makes life a little bit easier. Grab third. Alright, let's see what we can do. I know I can do better. I know I can. We'll go outside the inside. You can also throw nice big oppos over that. Which, that was honestly stunning, probably. There we go. We'll go the safe route. 
I did not want to do that. Oh my god, I almost looped it. Alright, we're gonna go outside so I can get straight up and hit this. Oh my god, I was second gear and just had to seat bounce it. See when I when I just freshly lock in, I can cruise around these tracks very nicely actually. I do like a nice, long, wide open track. Not too hard, not too easy. It's just perfect. And this is definitely one that you need to pick up if you don't have it. Links in the description. Oh my god. Definitely not trying to get too crazy with the steeziness. Run the outside. Let's speed cool down a little bit. Oh my god, that section. I could not imagine riding that one in real life. That, that section would abuse you. Oh my god. Scrub right over the top of it. Land in a wheelie. You can just scrub that. Oh my god, I'm in first gear? What was I doing just then? Beautiful. Probably cut to the inside here. No! I'm not going to risk it for the biscuits. I'm going to play it safe. Just go outside, try to land on top of it. All right, this has got to be like a few minute lap. Got to be. I do like running this inside though. Wow, I think that's the first time I actually ever got it. Oh no, the inside, the inside didn't work. That's okay. No, 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 no. Oh my God, we were so close to the nice clean lap. Why did Peboso have to just, like, grab a hold of my front tire? There we go. That was beautiful. Let's see. Can we get on the inside here? Yes, we can. What's that lap time looking like? 347. Which, I mean, I, it wasn't my fastest lap time on that one. The last one that we did there. But I mean, it's better than the four minute lap time that I just had. Okay. But all right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Be sure to smash that subscribe button. Let's hit 500 subs. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow.